Are you ready to experience a day filled with divine blessings and unexpected miracles? Have you ever wondered how God can transform your ordinary moments into extraordinary testimonies? Today, we'll explore the profound truth of how blessing your day can unleash God's favor in ways you never imagined. If you believe that God can make a difference in your life today, let us stand together in faith. I will pray a fervent prayer with you in the mighty name of Jesus. So watch until the end and open your hearts to receive the blessings of this prayer. My friends, imagine your life as a vast field of untapped potential. Each day is like a seed waiting to be planted, nurtured, and harvested. Just as a farmer carefully tends to his crops, we too must cultivate our days with faith, hope, and love. In Proverbs 16, verse 3, we find this powerful wisdom. Commit your works to the Lord, and your thoughts will be established. This verse reminds us that when we dedicate our day to God, He aligns our minds with His divine purpose. We'll explore three powerful perspectives on how to bless your day and invite God's abundant grace into every moment. Number one, the power of morning dedication. My dear friends, let's begin by examining the profound impact of dedicating our mornings to God. When we start our day with reverence and gratitude, we set the tone for everything that follows. Think of your morning as the rudder of a ship, guiding your course through the waters of life. Just as a small rudder can steer a massive vessel, your morning dedication can direct the entire trajectory of your day. In Psalms 5, verse 3, King David writes, My voice you shall hear in the morning, O Lord. In the morning I will direct it to you, and I will look up. This verse beautifully illustrates the importance of seeking God at the start of each day. By turning to Him first, we align our hearts with His will and invite His guidance. Consider establishing a morning routine that includes prayer, meditation on scripture and worship. Even if it's just for a few minutes, this practice can transform your outlook and prepare you for whatever challenges lie ahead. As you dedicate your day to God, remember to surrender your plans and expectations. Often, we become fixated on our own agendas, forgetting that God's ways are higher than ours. By offering your day to Him, you open yourself to divine appointments and unexpected blessings. In Proverbs 3, verses 5 to 6, we're reminded, Trust in the Lord with all your heart, and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him, and He shall direct your paths. When we acknowledge God in all our ways, including the start of our day, He promises to guide us. This guidance may come through a sudden inspiration, a timely word from a friend or a shift in circumstances. Be attentive to these divine nudges as you navigate your day. My friends, by dedicating your mornings to God, you're not just starting your day. You're igniting a powerful spiritual force that can transform every aspect of your life. Number two, cultivating gratitude throughout the day. My friends, as we journey through our day, let's explore the transformative power of gratitude. Gratitude isn't just a feeling. It's a choice that we make moment by moment. It's like wearing a pair of special glasses that allow us to see God's blessings in every situation. When we choose gratitude, we shift our focus from what's lacking to what's abundant in our lives. And first, Thessalonians 5, verse 18, we're instructed, In everything, give thanks, 
for this is the will of God in Christ Jesus for you. This verse challenges us to find reasons for thanksgiving in all circumstances, not just the pleasant ones, even in difficulties. There's always something to be grateful for, a lesson learned, strength gained, or a deeper reliance on God. Practicing gratitude throughout your day can dramatically change your perspective and experience. Start by acknowledging small blessings, a warm cup of coffee or tea, a kind word from a stranger, or a heartwarming message. As you train your mind to notice these gifts, you'll find yourself surrounded by evidence of God's love and care. Gratitude also has the power to combat negative emotions like anxiety, fear, and discontent. When we focus on what we're thankful for, it becomes harder to dwell on our worries or complaints. In Philippians 4 verse 6, Paul advises, Be anxious for nothing, but in everything, by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Notice how thanksgiving is paired with prayer here. When we approach God with gratitude, our requests are framed by trust in His goodness. Try keeping a gratitude journal, writing down three things you're thankful for each day. This practice can rewire your brain to naturally seek out the positive in every situation. Share your gratitude with others, too. Express appreciation to those around you. It will bless them and reinforce your own thankful spirit. As you cultivate gratitude throughout your day, you'll find your heart lighter, your joy deeper, and your connection to God stronger. And number three, ending your day with reflection and surrender. My dear friends, as we approach the end of our day, it is important to reflect on God's faithfulness and surrender our cares to Him. Just as a captain reviews the ship's journey at day's end, we too should take time to acknowledge God's presence in our day. This practice of evening reflection allows us to see God's hand in ways we might have missed earlier. In Psalms 4 verse 8, we find this comforting assurance. I will both lie down in peace and sleep, for you alone, O Lord, make me dwell in safety. This verse reminds us that true peace comes from recognizing God's constant protection and care. As you prepare for rest, take a few moments to recall the events of your day. Where did you seek God's guidance? How did He provide for you? What lessons did you learn? Acknowledge both the victories and the challenges, thanking God for His presence in all of it. This reflection helps us maintain an eternal perspective, seeing our daily experiences in light of God's bigger plan. Next, practice the art of surrender. Often, we carry the weight of unresolved issues, worries about tomorrow, or regrets from the past into our sleep. But God invites us to cast all our cares upon Him. In 1 Peter 5, verse 7, we're encouraged. Casting all your care upon Him, for He cares for you. Imagine physically placing your burdens at the foot of the cross. Release your grip on things you can't control, trusting that God is working even while you sleep. This act of surrender allows you to enter into rest with a peaceful heart and a clear mind. Consider ending your day with a prayer of thanksgiving and surrender. Thank God for specific ways He blessed you. Ask forgiveness for any shortcomings and entrust tomorrow to His capable hands. You might find it helpful to write down any lingering concerns or tasks for the next day, symbolically handing them over to God. My friends, as you develop this habit of evening reflection and surrender, 
you'll find that your sleep becomes more restful and your mornings more hopeful. You'll wake up ready to face a new day, knowing that God has been working on your behalf through the night. Now, to all those within the sound of my voice, let us go to the Lord in prayer. I want you to pray this prayer with me so that you can have all the blessings of this prayer. Let us pray to our gracious and loving God. Heavenly Father, Creator of all, I come before your throne of grace with gratitude and praise. Your majesty fills the earth, and your love reaches to the heavens. I praise you for your infinite wisdom and boundless mercy. Lord, you are the Alpha and Omega, the beginning and the end, the author of life and the giver of every good gift. I praise you for your faithfulness that endures forever and your compassion that never fails. Thank you, Father, for the gift of this new day and the opportunity to walk in your presence. I am grateful for your guiding hand, your daily provisions, and your sustaining grace. Thank you for the blessings that you've poured out upon me, both seen and unseen. Lord, I confess my shortcomings and ask for your forgiveness. Cleanse me from all unrighteousness and help me to forgive those who have wronged me. Father, I dedicate this day to you, surrendering my plans and desires to your perfect will. Help me to start each morning with a heart of devotion and gratitude. Open my eyes to see your blessings in every moment, big and small. Grant me the strength to cultivate a thankful spirit, even in challenging circumstances. Teach me to reflect on your goodness at the close of each day and to surrender my cares into your capable hands. In the name of Jesus, I declare that this day is blessed and filled with divine appointments. I rebuke every plan of the enemy to steal my joy or distract me from your purpose. In the mighty name of Jesus, I bind the spirits of worry, fear, and discontent. Lord, I pray for a renewed mind that is focused on your truth and goodness. Fill me with your peace that surpasses all understanding. Guide my thoughts and actions that they may align with your will and bring glory to your name. Help me to be a vessel of your love and grace to everyone I encounter today. Father, I ask for your protection over my life, my loved ones, and my possessions. Shield me from harm, danger, and every attack of the enemy. I pray for physical, emotional, and spiritual healing. Touch every cell, every system, and every organ in my body with your healing power. Restore what has been broken and renew what has been worn down. Lord, I rebuke every sickness, disease, and spirit of infirmity in the name of Jesus. I declare that by the stripes of Jesus, I am healed and made whole. Father, bless the work of my hands and make it fruitful. Prosper me in all my endeavors and grant me favor with both God and man. Open doors of opportunity that no man can shut. Give me wisdom to make godly decisions and discernment to recognize your leading. I pray for financial blessings, not for selfish gain, but to be a blessing to others and to further your kingdom. Lord, I lift up my loved ones before you. Extend the same blessings, protection, and favor to them. Draw them closer to you and surround them with your love and grace. Lord, as I say this prayer, together with everyone listening, I am grateful for every heart that is opening before you right now. We come in agreement, 
lifting each other up before your throne. Father, bless us with the strength to dedicate our mornings to you and to cultivate gratitude throughout our days. Help us to end each day in reflection and surrender, trusting in your unfailing love. In the name of Jesus, we declare that our days are blessed and filled with your presence. We claim victory over every challenge and obstacle. Pour out your Holy Spirit upon us, empowering us to live lives that honor you. We thank you for your protection, provision, and guidance. May our lives be a testament to your goodness and grace. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever and ever. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. If you were blessed by this prayer, type the word Amen in the comment section below. I declare that all the blessings of this prayer are now upon you. In the name of Jesus. You can help us to reach more persons and spread the gospel. You can do this by sharing the video with a friend or family member and by clicking the like button. Also remember to subscribe to our channel Daily Jesus Prayers. For more videos, that will bless your heart and uplift your spirit. We appreciate all your support. You're blessed to be a blessing. Please feel free to leave your prayer request in the comment section so that we can present them before God for your blessings and victory and so that other believers on the YouTube platform and all over the world can join us and start praying for you right now. Stand in faith with us while we pray. To God be all the glory. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all.